We're here with uh, Vincent from Acacia Strength. Oh, it's 18. You got all the signs. It's straight down to it, I guess. Um, your new album, Contact, comes out on August 19th. It sure does. Um, how's the new song, the Doctor Doom, been received by the fans um, so far? It's been pretty good, you know, with the uprising of MySpace and everything like that. It's been uh, easier to get new songs out before the record comes out and all that stuff. So we did the demo a while ago and put it up on the site. And kids are kids are into it, you know. People know the words and stuff, which is it's really weird to me. We've never put out an album where you know kids know the words to a new song before the album comes out. So it's, it's, it's pretty cool. Yeah, cool. And um, let's see. Oh, you're you worked with a new producer this time. Yep. Uh, Zeus, right? Zeus. So how is it compared to working with uh, Adam? Zeus is. Uh, he's a little bit more laid back, I guess. He's not, you know, Adam's really funny, like, all the time. He's just always on, and Zeus is kind of more like a, you know, whatever, I don't care, shut up. Just fucking play your instruments and go home. So, yeah, that that's the difference between Zeus and Adam. I mean, they're both upper echelon producers as far as our genre is concerned. So, I mean, they're both. Yeah. Um, train. <laughs> the, uh... The writing styles between Continent and Dead Walk. Give it a second. <laughs> train. Yeah. Train. Fuck yeah, trains. Train. Right. So, um, what are the differences in writing this album compared to like Dead Walk, 3750? Um, well, 3750, I don't even remember yeah. anything about. Um, Dead Walk, we kind of didn't have a lot of time to write it. So it was like one of those things where in between tours, like two weeks here and there, we had to write songs. Even on tour, I wrote songs. This album, we actually took time off. Um, so we had a five-month period where we were writing and recording. So we had all the, basically all the time in the world. And we all just like, you know, busted shit out. Yeah. Pretty, pretty, pretty easily. How about from a lyrical standpoint, um, this album to Dead Walk? It's hard. Coming up with lyrics, man. Like, don't let anybody tell you it's it's easy. Um, coming up with stuff that's halfway decent, anyways. I mean, I had to really, I had to, I isolated myself from people for a long period of time just so I could come up with good stuff because that's what the album's about. Like, it's about isolation, and yeah. and stuff like that. So, I guess. I mean, a lot of the, the last records I just wrote, you know, when I whenever I could, but this time I actually sat down. And shit, so. Yeah. Cool. And uh, on the touring, you're uh, on the Sun Your Buns tour right now. Um, how do you like your tour mates so far? It's a fun time, dude. Yeah? It's a fun time. I've known Sense of Flood for a really long time. So, I mean, we did, we did a tour with them about four years ago. Um, and I've known Al Shaw Parrish for a while. I've known Warriors for a while. So it was just like, get a bunch of friends together and do the damn thing. Warriors aren't on the tour anymore. I'm kind of bummed out about it. But, you know, yeah. what can you do? Um, so... You're on the last day of this tour, on the 29th, you're going to be filming your DVD yeah. right next to your hometown. Yep. And uh, any speculations on how it's going to go compared to... I don't know. <laughs> I, I hope it goes well. I mean, every time we play, even around our home area, it's, it's fucking awesome. That's why we're doing it there. Because, mm. you know, it's the best place to do a live shoot, I guess. Um, this is this is like, we're doing the first half now, and we're going to do the other half in December. So hopefully we'll go home. Yeah. yeah. Be a good time. Come on out. I got a quick question. What's that? Um, I was out at the Metal Fest, New England, and the scene there was a lot different. What do you think of the scene here versus the scene there? Um, I think kids are more, or kids are angrier mm -hmm. in the Northeast. You know, kids that, kids in Massachusetts and Connecticut and, you know, New England in general, just angry kids, you know. So they have a lot of aggression and they get it out. Here, kids just want to have a good time. It's sunny all the time, it doesn't rain, kids are just happy, you know, they're ready to party. So that, that's really the, the two main differences that I notice. Like kids here are just in good moods and kids in the back east are just like pissed off, which is, that's where, where I come from. Now why did you shave your beard? Uh, it, it's, I don't know if you've noticed, but it's about 100 degrees out right now. And having a beard on your face is like having a sweater on your face that you can't take off. Yeah. So I shaved that. Also, I was getting bugs stuck in it when I was... Oh, great. Like There's a... Slow moving train. That's okay. We'll deal with it. It's fine. Fuck it. Yeah. Um, so I've heard a lot of people calling you guys kings of chug chug. Lots of people. Really? I've never yeah. heard that before. 
You haven't heard that one before? No. I've heard, I've seen a few fan sites through other fans of yours calling you guys the kings of Chug Chug. All right. Is ruling the thing? genre. Yeah, pretty much ruling right. the genre. It's fair, I guess. Stuff like that. You like the name at all? I or would you rather chug? When I think of chugging, I think of just drinking beer really fast. <laughs> I don't know. I guess. I mean, yeah. A lot of bands do it. A lot of old bands that are like older than we are do. You know? We're obviously not the most original band in the world. We just like playing music that we like. So I guess Kings of Chug Chug. We haven't. Yeah. Uh, a shirt that says Chug on it a bunch of times. That was meant to be like. A, Get wasted shirt. I guess. Yeah. I don't Where I can don't I know. find that shirt? You can find that shirt inside. Okay. I have to go look. It's a tank top, actually. <laughs> See, it's cool. It's hot out. Whatever. And uh, any any uh, preview into any new videos coming out for you guys? We're actually videos? shooting a we're actually shooting a video the day after we get home. Like the day after the DVD shoot, we're doing a video shoot. I mm. think. I'm pretty sure. And it's definitely not going to be a serious video because we can't do a serious video after the one we just did. Tether ball. Tether ball. Tether ball. Goofy. We're a goofy band, I guess. Amazing. Um, yeah, it's it'll it'll be it'll be entertaining to say at least. I have it's all up here. I can't tell. I can't tell you. About the battery's it. getting low. The battery's getting low. Yeah. <laughs> shit. A piece of shit. The camera here. Yeah. All right. And I guess that'll be it. Cool. Buy diamond cut. Listen to Cockpit. Hold on. Well, what do you think of Todd from Heavy Metal Source? <laughs> Todd from Heavy Metal Source can suck my dick. End.